Just gonna have to deal with me wearing a backwards cap because I did not actually do my hair yet today. Anyways, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, yes, I know I have not posted since last month with my November bullet journal, and hopefully at least one of you out there is wondering, where on earth is my December bullet journal video? Now, believe me guys, it's coming. But as usual, you know me, I'm posting it late. Hopefully, now that it's my Christmas break, I can post it eventually. <laughs> but that's not what I'm going to be doing today. So recently, I did attend this um, art bazaar at BGC. Unfortunately, I did not get any footage there because I was so taken back by how amazing a lot of the artworks there are. And I just ended up buying <laughs> a lot of them at the art bazaar and now I am broke. Oh well, I'll earn money somehow eventually. I mean, I really started earning money on my own by selling my own stickers. And honestly, I need to post those on my art account. Plug, follow it. That's actually how I've been earning money on my own. Like I go out with my own sticker designs and then I sell them to like, you know, my close friends or some, some people like that. But anyways, going back to what I, was, what I was meant to be doing, I'm going to be showing you guys what I actually got at the Art Bazaar. Now take note, I while I was at, while I was there, I was getting like a lot of their business cards, like you know, with their Instagram handles or artist names and whatnot. But I unfortunately was not able to get uh, everyone's uh, business card. So if you're someone I bought from the Art Bazaar and I did not mention you, I am so sorry. But I love your artwork. First off, so I just bought this one sticker from Diane Conception and her name is Art of the Conception. Now, I really just bought this sticker that's of a floppy disk, I think it's called. Now, honestly, I actually liked her when uh, I bought from bought this from her because she said that they initially had like a VHS tape or something, and then they said she said that it was actually sold out, so I ended up getting this instead. I'm fine with it, honestly. I had to make sure that the floppy disk wasn't the flop. Anyways, moving on to the next thing. All right, so these next three stickers I bought from Team of Olats. And uh, uh, on their business card, there's a lot of names, so um, I'll be putting them in the description box below. Same with the, the rest of the artists I bought from. What I got from them was these three stickers right here. One is of this uh, polar bear that looks like he's like falling to a side or something. Another one is this uh, chow chow that looks like it's uh, running. And then this last one is basically me almost every day. This panda bear is actually eating a stick of bamboo. And I love all three of them because they're so cute I cannot eat them. Ah! Alright, moving on to the next thing. Okay, now this is one of the artists that I actually forgot the name of. Well, exactly. But it says here on the uh, packet that they gave me, it says Pixel Hero, which I'm, I, I think that's their name but I'm not 100% sure so if you're the person that sold me this I'm sorry that I forgot your name and I didn't get it but I actually got this uh, pixelized version of Totoro and these two characters I forgot the name of because look thinking back I'm pretty sure My Neighbor Totoro is the only movie of this uh, uh, studio I think that I'd actually able to watch before but I've been meaning to watch more movies from the studio other than my neighbor Totoro but this one though I love it's so cute ah! now this next artist oh no I dropped it on the floor now this next artist I got from I did not get a business card but I did take note of the uh, artist's name I did not get a business card though so the the artist's name for this one is XY Artworks I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong but what I got is this little sticker right here it's of this uh, girl from like the nose up to her neck and then her hair is almost like a, a galaxy thing with like, you know the purple and the blue hues and then they're like stars and stuff I actually kind of like this and I'm gonna have to figure out where I'm going to put this and the rest of my stickers and now if you're a fan of Mean Girls like me you'll recognize this little phrase right here cool yeah I'm I'm just a fan of Mean Girls and I and when I saw this I was like I want this so bad. Like she even had like a few other Mean Girl stickers. Like I'm pretty sure she also had the uh, uh, Glen Coco one. I forgot exactly what it said. And I think it also had is butter a carb? Is butter a carb? Yes. Man, as tempting as those were, I needed to save money for everything else I needed to buy. <laughs> so these are the two things I bought from XY Artworks. Again, I'm sorry for pronouncing that wrong. If I'm pronouncing that wrong. Anyways, moving on to that one. Oh, this one, I'm pretty sure I bought, I'm pretty sure this person is who I bought the most items from. So for this next person, I, this next person, I'm pretty sure I bought like the most items from. It's, uh, her name is Jaro, 
and her Instagram name is Art by Jaro. And uh, first off, what I bought is another floppy disk, but it actually says something. It actually says save me. I kind of bought. I think I bought it because of the slight dark theme it had on it. Anyways, I'll let you guys figure this out. Now speaking of dark, I actually bought this this little guy right here. It's a sticker and it's of this guy and he's like in this uh, dark void watercolor looking thing. <laughs> Alright, this one is one of my personal fave items that I bought. Not only from her but overall that I bought. It's this card right here. And it's of this guy, he's like shirtless and then he looks like he's you know crying and then he also has this little cute flower crown on. Honestly, I I really love this stuff the moment when I saw it and it gave me inspiration for something else for me to work on. Not that I'm copying, I'm just being inspired by it, Jaro, if you're watching this. But yeah, I love this card and also the, the two stickers I got from you. Thanks. Alright, this one I, I think I forgot the name of the artist, but I think I saw that on, that like on the sign thing by her stand. I think it said like art by Rosa or something like that. I forgot the name. I'm sorry if you're watching this. But really, I just got this letter D galaxy watercolor thing. thing. Because like, she had this... Did I drop it on the floor? She had this like set of all the alphabet letters in like a... What do you call this? A set pack. But I was able to get the letter D on, on, on its own. Because, you know, Dexter D. Mm. Well, yeah, I wanted the letter D. Or should I say, I wanted the D. Moving on! <laughs> Alright, now this is the last one. Now this stand right here, they actually had three business cards, so I'll just go ahead and say their names right here. Uh, name is Frey, and then Art by Albi, and then last one, hopefully I'm pronouncing this right, I'm pretty sure I'm not. Uh, Chai Lattes. I'll link them in the description box below. I think they weren't the only ones that were like this, but they're actually working students, and they really made me I don't know, inspired to sell my own sticker line again. Like, I've been selling you know, my own sticker line, which I get to post on my art account. Plug again, <laughs> follow it. Yeah, it actually inspired me to, like, you know, even if we're not like actually hired like in a company or something, like for an actual job, we can actually still work on our own time with like, you know, our own artsy skills. And what I bought from them is one, this card right here. It's uh, uh, the three uh, Pokemon evolutions. Like from Chikorita, Cyndaquil, and um... I'm sorry, I forgot this guy's name right here. I forgot his name, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then it had like, you know, the classic like, uh, Squirtle, Bulbasaur, and Charmander. Love them. And then the ones on the bottom, I forgot all of their names because I haven't been updated much on uh, this latest gen. But I only know Piplup and EBQAF. And uh, I'm gonna stick this up somewhere, like in my uh, closet or something. And now this one right here. Um, you know, this one I actually bought because I like the design and uh, I bought this bookmark right here and it has these uh, two, two animated guys and uh, I don't know why I bought the bookmark and the last book I read I haven't even made it at least to halfway of it because I got lazy to continue reading it but now that I have this bookmark I can actually go ahead and try to continue it over the Christmas break. Thanks to uh, Frey, Alibi, and Chai Lattes. Well, I, well, that's actually pretty much it. That's everything I got from this art bazaar. And again, I'm, I'm going to be uh, putting the Instagram handles of all the artists that I bought from in the description box below. So that you guys can check out, check out all of the Instagrams and, uh, you know, support your local artists. <laughs> and uh, I guess that'll be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this, please give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and then share this video with all of your friends because it actually uh, flatters me whenever I see like, you know, on my Facebook timeline, like, you know, your guys you know, sharing my videos and spreading my videos out to people you know. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.